While our standards for video quality have steadily increased over the last two decades, our desire to keep file sizes relatively small persists. One solution is to resize the video, but that might cause a drop in overall video resolution quality depending on how you do it. Video compression is the go-to solution for when you want to reduce your file size without changing the video's resolution, or noticeably lowering video quality. Doing so with free tools is relatively easy, but if you don't want a watermark on your result, you'll have to put in a bit more effort. Here's what you need to do. Before we begin, remember that compressing video files works best with an original, untouched video file. Trying to resize a file that's already been compressed may cause a noticeable loss in video quality. The surest way to compress a video is to use the open source program Handbrake, available on both Windows and Mac OS. If you don't already have it, just click on the link in the description below to download the installer. Open the app, then drag and drop the file onto your program window or click browse to look for and open your file. The software will detect your file's info and display it under source. For quick and easy compression, click on the presets button in the top right corner, then on the small arrow next to general. From the list, select the preset that mirrors your original file's resolution set to very fast, then check the format setting under the summary tab to make sure you're compressing to the same file type. For example, if you've got an HD MKV video in 720p, choose the very fast 720p preset, then set it to MKV. If you know what you're doing and you want more control over how the software compresses your file, feel free to check the other settings tabs and adjust your presets. General presets only go up to 1080p. To try this on 4K videos, check the Matt Roska list. Once you're ready, click on Browse to edit your file's name and choose where it'll save to. After that's all set, click on Start in Code to create a copy of your file. You can monitor progress in the bottom left corner with the time remaining displayed on the same line. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering video compression and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy. <laughs>